The Kerala Story. Yogi Tar Bihani on the Kerala story, I had the clarity about what the film is showing but I was anxious before its release. The Kerala story has been at the center of controversy ever since its release. Its actor Yogi Tar Bihani shares what necessitated the film, the bans on it, and more. When I took up the project, I had the clarity about what we are showing through the film, and how we want to keep women of all religions safe. In this film, they are talking about terrorist outfit ISIS, and they wanted women to be safe from this organization, not any religion. When Yogi Tarbihani took up the project, she had clarity about what they were showing through the film and how they wanted to keep women of all religions safe. However, before the release of the film, when there was so much going on, call for bans and people objecting to its intentions, she was a little anxious about what would happen. On the controversy around the film and the purported legitimacy or the lack of it, there is no way to be absolutely certain, feels the 27-year-old. The Kerala story has been one of the biggest blockbusters of this year despite being mired in countless controversies and outrage. The film, which was released earlier this month, managed to gross over 201.7 crore at the box office, becoming the third highest grossing Hindi film of 2023. The Sudipto Sen directorial came with a talented cast of actors that spearheaded this film about a group of women who are recruited to the Islamic State of Iraq and Syria ISIS, after being converted to Islam. While Ada Sharma played the main lead, Yogi Tarbihani played the role of Nima who was equally pivotal for the story. The film has been facing backlash from a section of political parties which have dubbed it a propaganda film. Not just this, the cast has also been receiving threats and subjected to online trolling for being part of the propaganda film. The Supreme Court on Thursday stayed the ban imposed by West Bengal government on the Kerala story. The Kerala story director Sudipto Sen has alleged that the film's distributors are receiving calls and being asked not to screen the film. One dot over 100 people have been arrested in the western Indian state of Maharashtra after one person died and eight others were injured in communal clashes. Reports say the violence, which took place in Akola city, was triggered by a social media post on a controversial film, The Kerala Story. The bans faced by the Kerala story have rekindled the age-old debate about the fine line between freedom of expression and censorship. Several local and regional authorities have banned the movie, citing the potential for unrest due to its sensitive content. Bihani, however, takes a broader perspective on the situation. Art often challenges the status quo and encourages people to question their beliefs, she expressed, demonstrating an understanding of the power her medium holds. However, it's disheartening when a platform for dialogue is silenced. Despite the challenges and controversy, the team behind the Kerala story remains steadfast. United by their shared commitment to the narrative they chose to present, they face the backlash together. Even amid the rising pressures, Bihani speaks highly of the creative process, and the team spirit that held them together. In the face of adversity, we grew closer as a team, Bihani recalled. Every member, 
from the scriptwriters to the production crew, believed in the authenticity of the story we wanted to tell. That collective spirit has been our strength throughout this journey. Bihani's journey has been a roller coaster, replete with extreme highs and challenging lows. From the excitement of portraying a character rooted in Kerala's rich culture to facing the brunt of controversies, she has seen it all. Yet, the spirit of the actor remains undeterred. I believe that as actors, we are storytellers. And every story has its share of believers and critics. As much as we appreciate the accolades, we must also accept the criticisms, she reflected. Bihani and her colleagues hope their efforts won't be in vain. Rather, they aspire for the film to continue sparking discussions, prompting viewers to delve deeper into the rich tapestry of Kerala's socio-cultural landscape. Their commitment to the narrative, and belief in the power of cinematic expression remains unwavering, despite the controversy. While the controversy around the film shows no sign of abating, the essential conversations it has sparked are crucial to our discourse about art, culture, and politics, Bihani added. As for the future of the Kerala story, it remains uncertain. With active bans in place in various regions, it is unclear when or if the film will be freely available for viewing across the board. Despite the uncertainty, Bihani holds on to optimism. We made the Kerala story for our audience. We believe in them and in the power of art to bridge divides, she said. It's our hope that, in time, the film will be accessible to all. The Kerala story is more than just a film, it has become a significant point in the ongoing debate on freedom of expression, censorship, and the role of cinema in society. Whether the audience agrees with its portrayal of Kerala or not, the film has undeniably sparked dialogue and brought these important issues into the spotlight. While its journey has been marked by controversy, the resolve of actors like Yogita Bihani and the entire team serves as a reminder of the enduring power of storytelling. As the saga continues to unfold, the Indian cinema industry and its audiences watch on, eager to see how this story will ultimately be told. Our objective was never to stoke controversy, Bihani expressed in an interview. She added, our goal was to share a slice of Kerala's life, a region that boasts an amalgamation of rich history, vibrant culture, and intriguing complexity. Thanks for watching.